Sabaha everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today I have for you my review of this truly wireless pair of headphones. Uh, they're small, they're compact, they have a battery powered case that will recharge them, but not only that, all of this is under $35. This is TK and I want to say thank you very much for allowing me to check out these headphones, but let's not waste any time. Let's see what makes them special. MJ Jung is the name of the company. Model number is MJ Jung M1, true wireless headphones. As I said, the case itself has a built-in battery and it charges them using these little connectors. We'll get a chance to check that out. Embedded microphone for phone calls, truly wireless stereo. Obviously, there's no gonna be there's no wires between the two. Comfort fit and easy pairing. So it's very simple to pair, and I'll share that with you guys in a second. And of course, first thing they mention here is just the pairing instruction. They say hold uh, please hold down on both the buttons on uh, right and left ear, and then just wait for them for the light to start blinking. And then, of course, step two, turn on um, your Bluetooth on your phone and look for the MJ Young M1. And here is the case, uh, extremely small. It does use USB type C to charge, which is very nice. It's definitely a very nice upgrade from before. Uh, turn, opening it up, you'll notice there's the LED right here. You open it up, it turns green, telling you that it basically is charging them. Uh, you do have both earpieces inside and each one of them charges separately with the list, these little connectors and then it has ear, ear tips already put on them. We have a USB type C to USB type A cable to be able to charge it as well as two additional ear tips. These are in black. I'm not sure why they would have included the white ones that are the ones are, that are on it, but you can replace them with black ones in case you lose it. Uh, but overall, I haven't had the need for these and it's pretty simple. And of course, another user manual. Using them with your device is very simple. You take both pieces in the instruction they give us the instruction that you need to hold both of them to turn them on and for me I found that basically we don't need the left one press and hold take the first one press and hold it for about three to four seconds till you start seeing that blinking light on the inner uh, light not this one this one is basically where the microphone is and uh, once you see that go in directly into your Bluetooth device on your phone and then connect it so you see right there I have the MG Young M1 and that's it. Using them is very simple. Using these is pretty simple. Just use the actual tip, put it directly into the ear uh, ear canal, and then twist the earpiece a little bit to the to the back. And you're, once you have it in there, you'll feel that really good seal. And then that's pretty much it. It's almost in, uh, invisible from the front. There's no dangling pieces. You don't have to worry about things like that. And of course, putting the second piece will work the exact same way. Main benefit, of course, is you can initiate the music from the phone or from the earpiece if the application is open. Meaning if you've been listening to music and you paused it and you left it and came back, you can press play again using the actual earpiece and it'll play again. Um, you just want to keep in mind, obviously, that the audio volume is no control. There's no control for that on the earpiece. Everything is on your phone. So. I'm going to actually just play some music on this. I want to share with you guys how it sounds. I'm going to try to put it next to the microphone. So the verdict on these headphones, it, this is actually a pretty good buy. For about 35 bucks, you really can't go wrong for truly wireless compact with a charging case on a pair of headphones. Uh, they provide good audio when you provide the good seal. So that was the reason why I was mentioning is make sure you put them in the ears correctly so that you have a good seal there. Uh, because as you have more sound from the outside, then it distorts the quality. But well, when you have a better seal, audio, audio quality is pretty good. Vo voice calls are pretty good. The microphone is actually pretty sensitive. Again, keep in mind, the microphone only works on the right ear. As far as audio quality when you're playing music, it's actually comparable to the price point. So I would say just expect good audio, don't expect the best. Uh, this is really just intended to be really easy, really quick, and available for you for an extended amount of time as you have that battery in the case. Um, as far as distance, you can go about 10 to 15 feet away with uh, Bluetooth without any obstacles. Of course, if you add obstacles in there, you're gonna have some challenges and it'll start cutting out. Um, other than that, pairing was pretty simple. Using them was pretty simple. Uh, there was a slight latency when I was listening to the video and that was only noticed when I'm watching people talking, so that if there's a conversation on screen. Other than that, I didn't really have any problems with that when, he was out, when I was watching like hands-on videos or YouTube videos and stuff. There was no problem. Uh, I want to say thank you very much to MJ Yoon for allowing me to check out these pairs of headphones. I'll give you guys a link in the description below for the price. I think it's currently listed at $35.99 or $34.99 on Amazon. So. Check the link in the description below for the best price for depending on when you see this video. Other than that, like and subscribe as usual. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thank you very much for your support and I'll see you guys in the next video.